What's up, YouTube friends and family? I'm Elvis. And I'm Michelle. And today we are in Buckhead, Georgia. Not to be confused with Buckhead, Atlanta, right? Right. <laughs> okay, so this is a very small town. And where is this town located, Michelle? All right, so Buckhead is in Morgan County. And this is um, the central area of the state, a little more north. And this town... Um, was incorporated in 1908 and the current population at the last census was 194 so it's a tiny little town damn 194 that's it yep but the wow. population um, did increase from 171 at the last census in 2010 so you know there's a few more people than than were here 10 years ago this is a tiny place for real so um, the name Buckhead, according to tradition, um, came from a pioneer incident where hunters shot a deer and publicly mounted the buck's head on a tree. <laughs> so that's, that's interesting. how they um, came up with the name Buckhead. So medium income is 68,854. Demographics, it's 83% white, 11% black, and a little less than 4% Hispanic. And this little town has a 0% poverty rate. Mm. And that's all I pretty much know about this place. <laughs> it's a <laughs> tiny town, so there wasn't really any, any information. Yeah, you can tell there's not much going on here. Yeah, I've never heard of Buckhead, Georgia, though. I didn't I didn't know that there was a small town called Buckhead. That old house to the left, bro. Yep, so. Um, there's one gas station here, which is on the left right here, that pink building, and it's actually a operating gas station. Does it have gas pumps? Oh, no, it's no, just, it's a, just convenience a little convenience store. store. You know what? Look at that gas pump on the side of the road right there. What the heck is that? Where? See that? Right there. Oh, yeah, on the left. Well, wow. Is there a gas station right there? And you just pull up and pump your gas right there. Those buildings are awesome. We got to um, show those buildings from another angle. Look at that sign. That's interesting. It says Federal Raid. I'm curious to know what that we'll is. We'll have to get out and walk for a few minutes. Oh, definitely. Maybe see yeah. some oh, of these wow. buildings. Look at this a church. A little closer up. That is beautiful. Wow. That is nice. A Macias Chapel. A Moss Chapel. I don't even know how to say that. Moss. I've never seen that word. Let's go down the street a little bit right here and then we'll get off and then check out those buildings. I really want to see those old buildings. Yeah, I have a feeling. There's not going to be much this out here. This is pretty much it. I yeah, mean, there's yeah. going to be a few houses. Yeah. Maybe a fire department because there was a sign that showed a fire truck. Yeah, but we're definitely going to go back and check out that um, those buildings in that downtown. I want to get a close-up of that gas pump, too. So what's this right here? Volunteer fire rescue personnel wanted. Oh. So, oh, yeah, let's go in here. So there's a little park over here. And then here's the... Buckhead Fire Department. This looks like just such a wholesome place, huh? Yeah. Wow. Nice little place. There's a lot of little historic markers, though. There's another yeah, one on right? the side of the road. Where? Right there. Oh, yeah. Should huh. we go see what it says? Yeah, you want to? Sure. Let's go. All right, hold on. Alright, so this looks like kind of a historic sign, if I had to guess. You know what's funny? That gas pump that we saw is on the... Um... <laughs> yeah, it is. Wow. So that must be a historic part of the town. Yep. So let's see what this says. Through the town of Buckhead was formally incorporated by the Georgia legislature in 1887 and recorded in 1908. Eight, the earliest documented reference to this community dates to 1819 and an account ledger for a general store located here. By 1823, a post office had been constructed and by the 1830s,
Baptist Church in 1890, a four-room schoolhouse that had 10 grade levels, employed eight teachers, and possessed an auditorium was constructed in 1900. Buckhead also enjoyed a thriving commercial center that included four general stores, two drug stores, a bank, a cotton buyer's office, three restaurants, a barber shop, a livery stable, and a hotel. Industries included a cotton gin, a grist mill, and a blacksmith shop. Several large fires have taken their toll on Buckhead through the years, destroying many of its old buildings. Additionally, the agricultural economy has shifted from cotton production to dairy operations. Hmm, interesting, huh? So here we are, guys. That's a post office for Buckhead. Look at that. It's tiny. Yeah. This building right here I saw online. Um, I was looking at Google Maps from, uh, I guess, a year or two ago, and that was um, a soul food restaurant. Oh, wow. But now it's just a roofing thing. I kind of wanted to see the restaurant. I wish it would have still been there. Got some monster trucks in front right here. So these are the buildings that we wanted to see right here. Pretty interesting, huh? I wish we knew what they were. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Look at those doors, man. How old are those doors? Wow. This is that gas pump I wanted to see right here. So this was probably the gas station right here, huh? Had to be. Okay. If the gas pump is right here in front. That is so damn cool. Look at that. It still has a Chevron sticker on it. You see it down there? Yeah. But do you think this is the original location or they just moved it here? Because mm. would it have been on concrete if it was? I have no idea. Yeah, that's a good question. I wonder if they just moved it here. It's just yeah. like a... Yeah, because where would the tanks be? You know, yeah. the tanks have to be underground. Well, maybe it was different before. I don't know, but that's interesting. Look at the... What's this right here? Oh, man. That is so cool. Wow. Damn, you just made me think now, for real. Where was this before? Probably wasn't here. I just put it here just as a historic yeah yeah marker ah you think it was probably here no right uh, well look is that a gas line or that's a it, water line? i don't know but it looks like some kind of line look this is a bell's grocery wow it's old what does that say right there it just says mm -hmm. twin vent Huh. So, I don't know. Maybe the gas pump was right there. You see that? Yeah. Who knows, man? This is so old. Look at that lock. It's corroding. You could probably hit it with a hammer and bust it. Wow. What's up with this piece of wood right here? Yeah. I love this building right here. This building is so cool. Wow. So, if anyone is from Buckhead and you know anything about this place where the old gas pump used to be We're yeah what's this right here yeah there had to uh, it had to be here because why would these things be here on the ground and there was obviously something here yeah. <sighs> wish i knew it's a cool little store huh Nice little country spot. Hunt's Brothers Pizza. It says wings, wing bites. Oh, look, a little um, store right here to the right. Look, there's an old gas pump back there. Too. Oh, yeah. Oh, we gotta go see that one. That one looks even older, but maybe because it's in the element, like in the trees and stuff. Look, town. Oh, my God, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh man guys check this check this out right here we found the buckhead town hall this is insane oh does my god 10? it does wow it's on the Na national register 
So this was the actual sign. Look at that. That is amazing. Oh my God. Is that door open? There's a stove, like not a stove, but like um, a heater back there or something. You see it? Yeah. Maybe that's where oh, they would wow. put the wood and heat up the building. That's so cool. And then you got this old store right here. Oh, they got a deer processing place right there. So loud. Sorry about that. Uh, sounds like they're, uh, what do you call that? A wood chipper or something? Yeah. Okay, so this is what I've been wanting to see right here. Look at this gas pump. So I wonder if this was a gas station, like if that's the original spot for it. I don't know. Wow. But I mean that. There's a tree like been... growing through the inside. You see it? <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't look like that's been moved. No, right? Wow. Look at the machinery inside. Oh man, that's beautiful. Wow. That is so damn cool. <laughs> I like the trees coming out of it. <laughs> Look, there's a little park back there for the kids. Yeah. Huh. All right, let's go. Want to go around this way? Yeah. Look, I don't know what this is or what it was, but you can tell that this has been here for a hell of a long oh that's granite look at that wow that's been here for a very long time i wonder what it was wow these old structure back here those doors wow man i hate the soul food restaurants gone that would have been cool to go in there and talk to some locals about their town that church over there is insane looking huh it's beautiful, wow. <laughs> All right, guys, so we found this, uh, what is it, like a one marker? One more historic marker. Yeah, this one looks interesting. It says Federal Raid. I'm gonna let Michelle read that. All right. So it says on Saturday, November 19th, 1864, federal troops under General Gary Sherman's 20th Army Corps drove a small detachment of Confederate soldiers out of Buckhead, ate dinner, and then destroyed the water tank, all railroad buildings, and a large supply of cordwood. Moving out of Buckhead, the Federals destroyed the railroad to the Oconee River. There, burning the bridge and railroad supplies, they destroyed gins and mills, 330 bales of cotton, and 50,000 bushel, bushels of corn. That night, they camped at Blue Springs, which is now Swords, on the plantation of Colonel Lee Jordan. Huh. Wow. Wow. It's crazy. Jerks. <laughs> All right, y'all. Well, I think that's that pretty much it for that Buckhead. Concludes Georgia. our tour of Buckhead. Yeah, it's beautiful. Very nice it's place. It's a cute little town. Look, look at the sign right there. Georgia Civil War Heritage Trails. Oh, wow. Huh. huh. That's interesting. All right, guys. Well, I guess we'll see you on the next one. Y'all like and subscribe. Peace. Bye, y'all.